Hey, baby. You like my record time on the goat course? Eh, oh, okay, that's a dad you don't want to mess with. <laughs> I know you heard them goats, boy. <laughs> Let me tell you about my 45 second time I had back in the day. Oh, well, yeah, thanks. <laughs> He's so happy! Oh, uh, yeah, I bet. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, I, I wasn't aware of that fact. Not to be a creep, but the texture on her on her back looks actually really nice. I'm not even saying that in a creepy way. I mean, they actually redid quite a bit of the textures in this game. I don't know, just her, the clothes on her back does actually look pretty nice. I'm just, just saying. <laughs> Poor Link. Yeah, we, we, we kind of need that horse... Okay, so now we're gonna have to go back into the forest and chase after uh, Ilya. After just quickly pulling out a slingshot, aiming high, and getting rid of this beehive. Oh god, the bees! Oh god, the bees are in my eyes! The water will save me! There we go. <laughs> I'm not sure if the water actually fends away the bees, but yeah, the bees will get angry at you, as you can see, so you need to, uh,. Need to look out for that. Also, one thing you're witnessing right now is that Link climbs in this game, uh, in the HD version, exponentially faster than he did in the original. Uh, I don't even think we'd be halfway up the tree right now in the original version, so that's actually another welcome change. And uh, uh, maneuvering up this tree is annoying. Okay, let's grab one. Oh god, camera, why? Okay, let's grab two, and now we jump. And roll. <laughs> no fall damage if you roll in this game. Ridiculous. Hey, Colin, did you see Ilya anywhere? Um, sure. Yeah, what is it? Well, you did break the rules. I love how, like, if you go down the tr line, this is all Link's fault. Just for, just for teaching them the sword lesson. I sincerely doubt that. You're on hero mode. Once Link chooses hero mode, the world chooses hero mode. Sorry, kid. It's mine. Are you kidding me? So it's the bullying tactic, the blackmail tactic, is it? Son of a bitch. But thou must. <laughs> that was strangely animated. Yeah, no problem, kid. <laughs> He's thanking us even though even though Link clearly made an attempt earlier to shoot him in the face with a slingshot. Uh sure. Horseback riding is just as fun as sword play. Well, maybe not in this game, but <laughs> um eh, maybe in real life, maybe. 
Okay, now that we've now that those freaking kids blackmailed us for our sword, let's go into the forest defenseless and res and rescue our horse from Ilya, because that won't go bad in any way. Okay, back in Faron Woods, and let's see if we can get uh, get our horse back. Get our horse back. Get it. And they locked the. Hey, could you open the gate, please? Are you kidding me? The future of this village depends on me getting this horse. Uh, sure. I'll give that a shot. Why not? You know, I've actually had it in some playthroughs that I've had it that I actually just go through the hole, which is pretty funny that, like, Link can just, like, I know that bitch is gonna close that gate on me, so I'm just gonna crawl in the secret way because grumble, grumble. Uh, I've always hated crawling in vents in, in this and Wind Waker. It's so... Um, I don't know. It doesn't feel responsive. Uh, yeah, I rescued, a, I rescued a pack of kids. Because I'm the greatest. Can I have my horse back, please? I also don't like that Ilya's like, you really scuffed up this horse, and like, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't think there's a single dent on Epona's model next to her leg or anything, so Ilya just says it for some reason. Well, thanks. Um, what is it? Oh, like, collecting all the pose? Like, don't worry. I won't even think of doing something like that. You have weird cat lips for some reason. <laughs> um, that's not good. Well, fuck. What the hell is that? I must pursuit! I must give chase! Uh, what's with the lighting change? What is going on here? Things escalated surprisingly quick- Jesus Christ! The end. Oh god, that's terrifying. <laughs> I already have the drive boards, bitch! <laughs> What's going on? Oh my god! We were a werewolf the whole time. No, if that's not a classic Zelda plot twist, I don't know what is.
again, I, I can't even stress how quickly things escalated from just, let's just rescue some kids in the forest, to the land is shrouded in darkness. <laughs> like, whoa, that was sudden. Uh, sure, I think we've deserved a save after that point. Sure, why not? You know, it's, it's not like we're a wolf now. What is going on? Uh, this is just a this is just a real dog day right now. Okay, <laughs> proceeds to list like proceeds to pull out pun books of every dog pun in the in the uh, in the literal book. Um, we're changing the ground right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, that was something. Who's there? Hello? Hi. Um, I, I could say the same thing about you, too. Um, you are kind of cute, rather than scary. I don't know. And, uh, <laughs> that certainly is, uh, something right there. <laughs> I'm glaring at something. Oh, fine. Now, how'd you know I was human? Someone's been stalking me! <laughs> Gallic gun! <laughs> Boo. <laughs> Did I get you? Uh, maybe a little bit. No, oh, cool. Instant transmission, isn't that? <laughs> she basically is a DBZ character. Okay, so, uh, yeah, as you can see, we're a wolf now, so, uh... <laughs> If you thought we were going to be playing as Link the whole time, we guess again, because, uh, well, to be fair, it's, it's pretty uh, pretty well advertised at this point that, yeah, you play as a freaking wolf in this game a lot of the time, so, which is funny, because this came out around the same time as Okami, and Okami was called a very Zelda-esque game, so it was just funny that she both, he plays a wolf in both games, and it's just, uh, it's pretty funny. Pretty sure it's just an unfortunate coincidence. Uh, get off my back, get off my back, this is not okay, I am not okay with this! Uh, okay. Okay, so now we have... Uh, thanks. So, yeah, now we have uh, a new companion with us, and, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't even know if the game has given her a name yet, but, uh, screw it at this point. You all know who she is. She is Minna, and she's gonna be our main, uh, helper character, Navi-esque character, Fi-esque character of the game. And, uh, yeah, she's gonna be helping us out through, uh, the game, like grabbing on ledges, for instance. And then one of the cool things is too, like for that for that one, we actually had the option of having her grab it or having uh, having Link just bite at it. So I don't know, just a fun thing you can do, I guess. And can I actually destroy this? I can't. Okay. Um, don't think there's anything left in here, so let's just keep heading through because we're in this dark, dank, filled sewer right now. <clears throat> Oh, I, I shouldn't have actually said that because we actually don't know about that yet. So I'm just gonna bleep that out. Never mind, I even said that. Oh, okay. Yes, as a wolf, you can actually activate a sense mode and see that there are ghosts everywhere. Where the hell even are we? Oh, 
That's not good. The other world? Okay, well, keep that in mind. Uh, yeah, honing your senses as a wolf. Uh, basically treat it like Batman's detective vision, almost. It, like, it'll... It'll show you things that you couldn't see otherwise, and uh, it's good to just check in every now and then. Mm -hmm. Yes, because the wolf, as a wolf, you're actually going to be doing combat as well, and combat is... Whoa, that is not what I was going for, but whatever. Combat is essentially the same as a wolf, where you have, uh, you have several different attacks, uh, depending on what... Uh, what button you're holding, uh, or whether you're Z-targeting or not, so... Uh, actually, I don't think Z-targeting actually matters. The c wolf combat is not nearly as, uh, in-depth as the human combat, as you might expect, because you're just a simple beast in this mode, so... Uh, yeah, but there is actual combat, and, uh, yeah, we'll actually, uh, be doing some of that quite a bit. After dealing with these gross rat things. Nothing even in that one for some reason. Oh god. Okay, there's gotta be another. There's gotta be a way to look, the, raise the water in here. There we go. That water is really pretty. I mean, as pretty as sewer water can get, I guess. Anyway, now that we've raised the water a little bit, we can actually, uh, well, we can raise this. And actually go through and, uh, find nothing. Never mind. <laughs> um, but now that we actually raised the water, we can actually, can you attack in water? You can't as a wolf. Oh, God. Please don't kill us. I keep forgetting that there's no heart drops in hero mode. Oh, my God. We gotta really be careful then. Um... I probably st should have stocked up on Red Potion, actually, when I had a chance as a human. Um, so, yes, uh, you really need to be careful in your remote. It should be it should be pretty obvious. Yeah, you and me both, buddy. We're both wondering that. Man, that'd be really handy if you could, like, let me do that, too. Uh, okay, well, we gotta find a way over then, then. Um, yeah, let's find a way around. There's a box to there if we wanted. There we go. Oh, God. Okay, well, we're just gonna ignore those guys, because we don't need to deal with them. Or apparently we do. No! Get away from me. That's really cool how Link, like, has it in his mouth for a while. He, like, it... Again, the combat in, the, in Twilight Princess just feels extremely visceral, which is something that uh, you can't really say about any of the other games in the series. It's just a very visceral combat style. And Minda is being re real tease right now, as Minda tends to do. So let's actually see if we can lower the water now, because we raised it before, but now we're going to need to get through there. Hey, oh, this poor guy. Don't worry, I'm sure I'm sure everything will be fine. Are you, is there Oh god, we're going to die. We're actually going to die here. This is it. This is over. Wow, that was quite the jump that Link just made. Again, I could, I could go smashing all of these skulls desperately looking for a heart piece or a heart or anything to actually, like, heal. But as a wolf, we're kind of screwed because there is no way to heal as a wolf uh, with well, whether hearts at least. So, um, yeah, that's really not good. We need to be careful. I am but a lowly soldier. I think you're going to be fine, man. Oh, wait. Actually, we can dig. Maybe digging will uh, provide reward. Yeah, we're, we're not going to come up with anything, are we? Again, hearts would definitely be appearing right now if uh, if this wasn't hero mode. Whoa! Uh, yeah, it did. Could we be somewhere in Hyrule Castle right now, maybe? 
That's just what my wolf senses are telling me. Not the fact that I've played this before. Okay, I'm gonna avoid those enemies like the plague because if I take another hit, we're actually going to die. I can't believe. Can't. No! 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 Get away! Get! No! 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 Please. Okay, we've really got to be careful. Okay, so one of the main mechanics that Minna can actually help you do is uh, basically quick time jumping, which is basically just um, think of it kind of like the uh, bounce pads from Sonic Adventure DX. I know that's a weird comparison, but where you jump to each pad and you press A on each pad, and it's really simple and really like you couldn't possibly screw it up even if you tried. Like you just have to jump between those pads, and as far as Minna is concerned, you have to jump between. Uh, each of the places she jumps. And you're also going to be walking on ropes throughout all of this. And uh, rope walking with uh, Wolf Link is a little frustrating. Um, it's very precise and very finicky, to say the least. Those keys are coming down. Oh god, that was close. Again, if I take another hit, I'm dead. There we go. Yeah, I hope I hope you're gonna get used to that boop boop noise of the of the heart meter because we're gonna be hearing it for quite a long time. Okay, let's see if we can get up there after we get a nice shot of Wolfling's butt. Wonderful. 